How's it going everyone? So in this video, I will be making a belly fat workout. So before I get started, please subscribe to my channel. If you haven't already, I do appreciate the support. It helps my channel grow. Also, please follow me on Instagram, DylanBerg999. Uh, so the exercise that we will be doing today is going to be leg raises. Uh, we'll do seven reps, 10 sets, 70 total reps. You can do 10 reps if you want to. I'm doing seven reps just because I mean, 70 reps is quite a bit of repetitions. 100 is quite a bit too. So pick which one I'm going to do. Uh, I'm going to do seven for today. I've also had quite a long day, pretty tired. So I don't want to go, I don't want to go too intense on this one. Oh, this one really, really hurts my groin. Um, but having some issues with it, depending on the ab exercise, like leg swings hurt it, scissors hurt it, leg raise hurts it. There's some other exercises that are good ab exercises and it doesn't do anything, like it feels fine. So I don't know, um, probably has to do with me doing anywhere from nine to 15 workouts per day. That's probably why, I mean, I'm putting quite a bit of, uh, quite a bit of stress on it. What you guys don't know too is that I'm uploading three vids per day, but again, I make anywhere from nine to 15 per day, and then I just schedule them at a later date. So if I do 70 reps of this workout, I might do another, actually I will do another ab workout and I might do 150 reps, and then I might do another ab workout, do another 150. So this may only be seven, 70 reps, but I also might make another two videos where I do 300 reps. So instead of 70, that's now 370 I'm done. So sometimes I even make 30 videos per day and that could be like six, 700 repetitions for my abs. So, I mean, that's probably why it's getting a little bit sore. Okay. But I mean, it's not too bad uh, at a later, or sorry, before it was really sore, but now it's not as bad. So, I mean, that's, that's a positive. Almost done making videos too. I'm on my sixth vid. Um, one more, I got a push up video after, or sorry, a chest fat video. And then I got four pretty easy videos after that. So I might push to get 11 done for today. I'm not quite sure. Nine at the very least I want to get done, but. Yeah, uh, pretty, I'm not gonna say a good day. Today kind of sucked. It went by quick though, but it kind of sucked. One. The reason why it kind of sucked was due to the simple fact that one of the guys that worked, he called in, didn't show up, had something to do with his wife. Um, this caused everyone to have to work harder and do more work because he wasn't there. So not his fault, he had stuff to do, whatever, but kind of sucks for us. So start making videos today at four freaking 30. If he would have showed up, I would have been making videos today at about 2.30 or Probably about 2.30. I was done my work at very early, half an hour earlier than most days uh, on Wednesday. So, I mean, kind of sucks, but it is, it is what it is. <clears throat> okay. Some good news though is we did get the contract. If you guys have been listening to me talk about work lately, in previous videos, we did get the contract for my job for the next seven years. So that's really sweet. The only thing that does suck is that my job won't be around for seven years. It'll be around for about another, another it's March right now, so probably about another year and a half. So I'm hoping it's done next. I'm hoping it lasts till the end of next September. That would be dope, even end of August. But if it's like March or April, I'll be really disappointed. I want it to be at least till the end of uh, end of September. That would be dope, but can't control that. Just have to wait and see what happens. <sighs> Oh, 
One thing that could happen is that I could possibly get another position at the company doing an easier role, but making more money. So um, there's only gonna be four spots, I think, for that position, and there's gonna be eight or nine of us. So I think it's based on years that you've been there, so I might be a little bit hooped, but I mean, anything can happen, you never know. Um, you never know, so. Good to stay positive, but don't really rely on it. I have been looking at other jobs. I found one really, really good job. Like I was so happy to have found it and I'm just gonna be waiting and I'm gonna call the company. If, if the job post, the job posting probably won't be on the, the website when, when I'm looking to apply. So I'm just gonna call the company and see if they have a position open. But yeah, the job is, um, it's um, hauling away recycled tires. So I found that job, it pays extremely well actually. It pays about five grand a month, so that's 60 grand a year. That's really good for just a labor job that requires zero thinking. You don't even have to drive the vehicle, you literally, Someone else drives and you just load up the tires at each site. So very easy to do. I'm very, I'm in good, good shape. So that's not a problem at all. So I'm pretty, pretty happy that I actually found a job like that. Again, I still have, I still have to apply, do the interview, stuff like that. But it, it's good just knowing there's jobs out there like that. I found another two jobs as well that I might be interested in. So that's that's pretty cool as well. So just giving me different options. I love having like a plan B. I never wanna, I never want to not have a plan B. I always like to have something that I'm thinking of just in case something, the main thing doesn't work out. Just, um, just good to do, to be honest. For a job though, I could wait. I could wait a while to be honest for a job. I got YouTube and my investments. I really, like that, that's what I mean. I was thinking about like taking a year off and maybe just doing YouTube investments, but I probably won't do that now. I probably will work full time, so. But if I don't find a job, then uh, I, I have a long time to find. <laughs> So yeah, pretty cool. Getting pretty hungry. I actually, uh, at the company, at the job today, they actually had hot dogs, which were really sweet. I had two hot dogs. Then they had, they, they, I asked, uh, I asked the dude that I was working with, I'm like, do they have, do they have pop there? And he's like, no, I don't think so. And uh, they did, they had Diet freaking Coke. That's my favorite. And it was in a cooler and had ice on it. So I'm like, yes. So I, uh, I had two hot dogs, had a Diet Coke, and then I talked to some of the coworkers there too. And yeah, it's pretty, pretty cool. That's, that's a good treat to have after a long day of work. Okay. So yeah, hopefully, uh, hopefully you guys don't get bored by me talking about this kind of stuff. I like talking about it because I like sharing my personal life with you guys. I feel like we connect on a deeper level and we get like a bond. So you guys can like trust me. Tr always trust your personal trainer. Always. I don't know. I just feel it. It's uh, it makes the videos more entertaining. And it's something to just, I don't know, it's, it's anything to talk about as long as we're not talking about belly fat for 10 minutes. In some of my videos, I will explain about calories and cutting weight, but not in every single video. In every single video, I don't wanna be talking about how to lose weight because it's pretty well exactly the same thing. So I like to talk about different things. End of video, thank you so much for watching. Please subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. Please like the video, share it. Please follow me on Instagram, Dylanberg999. Thank you.